Hey folks, it's Mike. Um, I'm back for now. Um, here at uh, Birds Hill Provincial Park, which uh, is about a 10 minute drive north of the uh, city of Winnipeg. Um, the past uh, month and a half since my last video on Gimli, um, I've been in a bit of a creative funk. Um, haven't taken a lot of great photos uh, for reasons. I'll explain. Um, but uh, for now, let's go! So anyway, uh, there are probably three factors that have uh, doused my uh, creativity, uh, photographically anyway, over the last month and a half. Uh, one would be my work schedule, two, uh, just the fact that all the leaves have fallen, and three, uh, COVID. Okay, so have like the deers and the birds like started decorating Christmas trees around here or something? I don't know man, this is weird. Crazy birds, crazy deer. Um, right now I'm currently on the sort of the north part of the North Drive in uh, in the park, and uh, it's a pretty popular spot for uh, for stargazing uh, and watching the uh, the Northern Lights when they're actually this far south, uh, which does happen from time to time. Uh, I came here a couple weeks ago because the, uh, the Northern Lights were supposed to be relatively strong. Uh, unfortunately, clouds came in, and all I saw were bright clouds lit up by the lights from Selkirk that way and Oak Bank that way. So it was a bit of a mess. In fact, I could probably show you a photo that I took from that night. It was a mess. Either those are squirrels or dolphins. What would dolphins be doing, doing here? I suppose I could get to, uh, you know, one of the three reasons for uh, my lack of uh, creative spark over the last month and a half. Um, yeah, I mean, with all the leaves dropping, all you're getting are barren trees with no leaves, which I don't know, to me it looks boring. Um, yeah, I mean, there are leaves on the ground, but you know, when it's windy and it's raining and it all just looks like a brown and yellow mess, it's not all that pretty. So yeah, that's, that's certainly one of the reasons why I don't like uh, late October and November before the snow really falls and, and stays. So, uh, yeah, that's 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 number one. I'm on the uh, Prairie Winds Trail, which is uh, just off the South Drive. Um, it's, uh, you know, starts out as uh, some nice woodlands. Uh, you can even uh, feed some chickadees if they're around and you've got bird seed. 
if you don't have bird seed, they, they, don't, they don't want anything to do with you. I've tried, they, they don't like me when, when I don't have bird seed. But I mean, as you can see, it uh, you know comes out into this nice sort of sweeping, hilly, uh, you know, forest, you know, plain, plain, you know, whatever. The fall, uh, you know, before the snow hit, and you know when there were still leaves on the tree, it actually looked quite nice. And then uh, you know, towards a couple weeks ago, back in you know mid November, it was okay. Um, Maybe got a couple of photos uh, when I was here last time a couple weeks ago, but that's about it. Yeah, he got a little cute little uh, baby tree here, just uh, you know, sitting in the field all, all on his own, with his you know bigger brother and bigger sister there, and uh, you know another. Uh oh, mama tree. Uh oh. Suppose I can get to reason number two why I've been feeling a bit. Uh, uninspired creatively over the last month and a half, and that's uh, work. Um, in these crazy uh, COVID times, I work from home uh, for a call center, um, and uh, I've been uh, moved from one project to another because some sort of emergency shut down with the, the previous project, and uh, there have been some crazy scheduling things that have been happening, and uh, it's just thrown me for a loop, and honestly, I kind of crave a little bit of stability. I think I'm finally getting it at work. I hope. Sheesh, these woodland creatures have been busy decorating for Christmas. They must uh, be expecting uh, Santa promptly at midnight. Cool. Here, birdie, birdie, birdie. Here, birdie, birdie, birdie. Where'd you guys go? I got some food for you. You like bird seed? No? Oh. So I suppose I should address number three, the uh, elephant in the room, AKA COVID. Um, my province of Manitoba is in what's called Code Red, where pretty much everything's locked down. Um, only essential travel, um, no travel up north. Um, you can only buy essential goods. You can't buy you know, non-essential goods like Christmas decorations. Um, and uh, travel outside of your area is strongly discouraged. I mean, we're allowed out. You know, we're not like you know, zoo animals or anything like that although some of us are, but whatever. Um, so yeah, I've had not a lot of chances to go out and I don't like being stuck at home, you know. Just, it is what it is.
So this is a bit of an interesting, uh, I suppose, treat in the, uh, the park here. There are some, uh, some trees that have actually been decorated for Christmas. Hooray! Merry Christmas, y'all. Coming down or what? Come on, you know you want to come down. I've been trying, I've been really trying to get uh, the chickadees to land on me and just stay for a while so I can take a photo, but they, they don't like staying a while when you don't have bird seed on you. Yeah, well, I tried. Anyway, now that the uh, snow is here for good, at least until April, late March, something like that, um, makes things a little better, I suppose because you've got a little more contrast between, you know, the white snow and, you know, darker trees and, and, and other stuff. Um, makes things a little more interesting for me anyway, so. And now that, you know, there's a little more stability at work, I will be getting out a little more often. Um, not necessarily outside the city much because of, you know, Code Red in, in our province, but uh, I'll do what I can. Um, although, I I reserve the right not to go out at minus 35 Celsius because that's just too cold. On that note, I'm out. Um, see you next time. Um, do the usual, like, comment, subscribe. Um, wear a funny hat. Go for it. I dare you. <laughs>